we're still talking wall art. Yeah, we've looked at calendars as a source for wall art, posters, fabrics. Now let's look at wallpapers. There's so many varied wallpapers today that you can get panels from to create great art for your wall. Whether you want to mount it like a canvas, or you want to frame it, or even put it in a dish. This one, I actually put a paper, a wallpaper, in a circular pattern on the inside. And the picture inside I actually got from a magazine. But there's so many papers that you can use for wall art, and you don't necessarily have to frame them or mount them. You can do as I did here on a plate. You can do a series of plates that you can put on your wall and create great wall art. Wallpapers, on the other hand, you can also use as wall art. This is a Paddington Bear wallpaper. I have taken panels from this wallpaper and I have framed it. Now you could do a bigger frame with a bigger mat on the inside, or you could do a series of small frames, but whatever you do, wallpapers can make a great source for wall art, to create your wall art. And don't forget, your children's art. Your children are always drawing something. Take a couple of their art, mount them, use them as wall art in your space. It will make them feel very good. And remember, we don't always have to make these art for our wall. We can make it for our friend's wall or our family's wall. It's Christmas time. We're looking to give gifts. Do something creative. Give a gift that comes from the heart. Do something special for your family and your friends. Now, have yourself a merry little Christmas. May your heart be glad.